And now to that big donation to Riley. It's dedicated to Duchenne muscular dystrophy, which is the most common form of the genetic disorder. The hospital already has a strong presence in Duchenne, but the $5 million gift aims at growing the Riley program, making it one of the best in the country for treatment and research. Elizabeth Elkis is president and chief executive officer of the Riley Children's Foundation. She joins me now to tell us more about the vision for this gift. Hi, Elizabeth. Thanks for being on the show. Hi, Kylie. Thank you so much for having me. It's a great story. Let's talk first about Duchenne. Give us a snapshot of the disease and explain just how devastated it can be for patients. Duchenne muscular dystrophy is a genetic disorder characterized by progressive weakness of the skeletal, heart, and lung muscles. It primarily affects males and is typically diagnosed by age five. Today, most patients with Duchenne ultimately die from heart muscle weakness, leading to heart failure. Okay, and I understand that typically people live into their 30s and 40s today, but we'll talk more about the research in a little bit. This gift is interesting. It comes from a family right here in Indiana who has a personal connection to Duchenne. So tell us just a little bit about their vision for this $5 million gift. This family is remarkable. Uh, this is a tremendous gift from the Ackerman and Nikoloff family, and it aims to make Riley a one-stop shop for Duchenne patients and families. This will ensure that no one needs to leave Indiana for care. All right, and one uh, benefit of this gift is going to be an immediate impact on care. It was so interesting. I learned these kids often have to see up to 10 specialists for their treatment. So explain how this gift is going to help simplify that process for families. For families impacted by Duchenne, a trip to the hospital means navigating multiple specialties and numerous appointments. Care coordinators make all the difference in the patient experience. So this gift will enable us to go from having one care coordinator to three, thereby serving our patients and families. It is fantastic. And the gift also allows Riley to establish a Duchenne Family Service Program, basically a concierge service to coordinate transportation, identify hotels, and make accommodations to meet a child's medical needs. In short, they assist with planning to ease the burden on families. These services by the Riley team will be provided free of charge. Alongside the growth of the program, Riley has formally applied to be a parent project muscular dystrophy care center. This stamp of approval is important because it signals to parents their children can get the very best care in the country right here at Riley. And a big future impact of this money as we look forward is how it's going to impact research. And you already mentioned some heart complications. Uh, it's the number one cause of death uh, for people with Duchenne. So explain how these dollars are really gonna forward research in the area of the heart. At Riley, Dr. Larry Markham, Chief of Pediatric Cardiology, is focusing his research on slowing and preventing fibrosis of the heart through precision medicine. Dr. Markham's goal is to identify potential therapies and advance two or three treatments to clinical trials in the next few years. It's also important to note that U.S. News and World Report ranks Riley in the top five pediatric cardi cardiology programs in the nation and the number one program in the Midwest. Looking ahead, the focus is on curing patients by fixing the root cause of Duchenne through the acceleration of gene therapy. This research is led by Dr. Roland Herzog, who is an internationally recognized expert in the field. And I know Duchenne is a devastating disease, uh, no cure for it at this point. Um, but just to wrap up here, on only a few seconds left, you say big picture, this gift really is about optimism. Can you explain what you mean by that? Absolutely, it's all about optimism. For years, the medical community has made incremental improvements in the care of boys and young men with Duchenne. Our vision is to take a dramatic leap forward through research, while at the same time, making a meaningful impact on access to care. The Ackerman and Nikoloff family philanthropic commitment of five million will serve as a powerful catalyst to help elevate our already stellar Duchenne program and make it a national model. This shows how a family with the capacity to give can change the outcome for so many. That's the beauty of philanthropy. All right, Elizabeth, excited to see this money make a difference at Riley. Thanks so much for being on the show today. Thank you.